Uncle Clyde was a little in front of me, but I just figured like, oh, I'm gonna paddle extra hard to like get in front of him or just to get in his vision, and then I'm gonna turn around for this bomb. And, and I was like, I just want Uncle Clyde to see me go for this thing. And then boom, right when I seen me pass him, or his, like he was looking right at my board, I just, oh, yeah, Uncle, boom, started turning my board around, like made sure he's seen it, like, yes. And when I stood up, I was like, uh-oh, I didn't have the momentum to like, get down, so I was like, uh-oh, so I aimed this way. I was like, I'm just gonna catch this thing and jump on the jet ski. If, if I have to, like, I'll just save myself. So I was like, whoa, and I kind of had it going a little bit, and then eventually I just remember hitting a couple chops, and then, and then I just launched, like, finally, I think I hit one, two, and then I went three, and I was like, if there's a fourth one, there's no way I'm landing it, and then there's four or five, and I was like, oh, and just gave up, and then, yeah, wiped out. Yeah, if it wasn't for Uncle Clyde, I wouldn't have got that wave. I wouldn't have paddled back out. I wouldn't have even like been in the event. Uncle Clyde got me in the event. I was an iCal pick. So I was like, Uncle Clyde, love you. Mad Steez, you too. <laughs> Thanks for the art.